Premier, which is called Best Diplomat, and we are honored today uh, to uh, nominate it and to be given uh, Mr. Rodrigo Ernesto Gomez, Minister Councillor of uh, Republic El Salvador, who was proactive all the time and participated on all our events and represents about uh, his country and shared with us uh, experience of fighting with COVID-19. I would like to give a, a word, uh, Mr. Rodrigo. Hello. Hello again, Ingrid. I am. Hello. I couldn't be. Hello again, Sergey. I couldn't be happier and more honored to that my country, El Salvador, has been taken into account for this important mm -hmm. diploma. If you allow me, I can show the diploma on the screen so everybody can see it. Show us. Thank you for taking this another into account. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank uh, the excellent Honorable Excellency uh, for uh, providing a fantastic platform for human lives. And uh, I really appreciate you for your efforts in striving for humanity on this uh, joyous day of uh, promoting love and harmony. Thank you once again for uh, having this award and we appreciate you today, sir. Thank you. Thank you uh, uh, for the opportunity to to speak and and indeed um, I had not realized that uh, the uh, anniversary of Magna Carta was in fact uh, yesterday um, I remember it well when it was signed um, no I'm, I'm not that old but um, uh, it absolutely right I mean important in terms of creating the Charter of Rights and the protection of various institutions and organizations to which the foundations of our citizenship is, is, is based. Thank you very much uh, for the invite, uh, Sergei. As always, a uh, very proactive man. And then Sergei is becoming almost uh, an Africanist. And then I've been getting, I've been getting regular uh, text messages to join this uh, Zoom. Hello. Uh, I am uh, honored to be part of the uh, uh, part of this meeting. I am a medical doctor, dermatologist, and uh, for the last 26 years I've been uh, working and living uh, in Abu Dhabi. And um, lately I've been uh, uh, producing uh, feature films. I've produced three feature films, and. Um, uh, I am in a project for another one. Hello everyone, I'm Daria Matyshova. I'm uh, a columnist of the US Diplomacy Journal and uh, I would like to pose um, such a relevant question connected with the prospects of, uh, of finishing the COVID-19 pandemic. Amazing to meet you all here uh, and thank you for the opportunity, Mr. Sergey. Uh, we would like to introduce our global project which will take care of all the industrial sectors and an innovation center that is going to start in Bangalore city, India. It's going to have covering healthcare, education, technology hub, R&D facilities, manufacturing and all the sectors that we can think of in the terms of innovation that's going to help the humanity and also help a lot of opportunities for foreign companies to be a part of Make in India initiative. So I welcome you all for this meeting and I look forward to connect with you and talk to you soon. Stay in touch people. I'll share my contact details. We can discuss in detail. Thank you so much. I've been in Bulgaria and also in Dubai a long time ago. I had a business in Dubai from 95 till 2016. And it was dealing with uh, transportation between uh, Dubai and Russia and China and Russia and logistic uh, company. So in Bulgaria, I opened other telecommunication company plus uh, nanotechnology products, which we're producing in Moldova. Uh, this product, it will be for uh, mobile uh, radiation, anti-radiation for any electronic devices. We want to keep our links with the world and with Russia 
and uh, all our friends. I've I've seen uh, friends who are here from uh, India, Bangladesh, and other parts of the world. Um, so what we stand for in Singapore is that we want to keep global supply chains open. Uh, I would like to stress that Singapore did not impose any trade restrictions on exports. Uh, and we are now working, you know, with uh, Russia and the Eurasian Economic Union. Uh, we signed a free trade agreement last year and we are trying to implement the free, free trade agreement uh, that was signed last October. So that's all I would like to say and thank you so much for inviting me and thank you for your attention. Hi, I'm Dr. Ramjit Khan Pathan. I'm from uh-huh. Mumbai. And uh, uh, I'm I'm in the head of clinical pharmacology. I'm a doctor, and uh, recently been awarded as a World Peace Ambassador, and uh, as a, um, working specially for the cancer awareness program for the rural area in Maharashtra, Mumbai, and uh, uh, specially working for the needy and poor people who are really the need and help from our side. So I'm doing these things and uh, charity work for the specially for the cancer patients. And uh, uh, it's a really honor for me, uh, and uh, thank you so much, Mr. Sergey, uh, for uh, inviting me in such a wonderful talk and introduce me in such a good, uh, very nice platform. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs>